Ladies and gentlemen, welcome your faces back to another Hearts of Iron 4 Millennium Dawn episode. Here is Poland. This is episode 34 in our long-running daily episodic series. Boom. Nailed it. I'm going to go ahead, jump right into it, because it is late. Extra 5% monthly pop. We kind of figured out in the last episode. Well, that is bloody lovely. We're in an economic boom, ladies and gentlemen. Sensational. In the last episode, we kind of had a look at some of the states, right? And there's this stat here that says relatively populated. And it gives me 17 out of... 56 slots now because i've also got the farmers it also gives me plus eight percent of that 56 which is an extra two slots that i can build in now that's why we're going with the increased monthly population we've got two of those research slots there um so we can get more people hopefully get more building slots have a look at the money money we're making almost an extra billion a week just on economic boom uh, what else do we get from that construction speed and extra stability that is lovely gdps are over a hundred thousand And we need an extra 240 to go neo-imperialism, but we need to be nationalist. So, considering we're in an economic boom now, and we have more money, let us do a nationalist propaganda campaign for 120 days. Are you, are you, yeah, you, you, just fuck off, man. You just, you just pissing me off now. War in Afghanistan's over. The Afghan North Alliance is declared victorious. Congratulations, sire. You win. Just taking on some debt there. I'm assuming that's because I'm doing a nationalist push. And... Yeah, these guys are going to get 0 0.004 per day. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. That was odd. I thought my game crashed. The music just switched up on me. Okay, fair enough. Infrastructure is being done in Turkey. Infrastructure in Gotland is being done. Currently making 300 million from international investments. Let's go uh, shift left click. Left click. Open up to 19% corporate tax. Lose some factories there, but money wise, I would rather have the money in the bank. Not be worried about that. Because we are doing, spending 5 billion a week now. Just want to be able to not go into debt because of it. Speaking of debt, let's go ahead and repay off that loan that we took. And you can see the Ruch Naru Dawi. 
popularity rising. So we're at 28 army XP. Let's duplicate you. Light infantry, light infantry, light infantry. Um, add some artillery in there. Gives us less org, more defense, more breakthrough. And we will call this the 40 width swords. Boom. Nailed it. And we won't give them a katana. We will give them the kniffy. We will tell them they are an elite unit. Hoorah! And we will drag you just below Lightning McQueen there. Civil war in Afghanistan calms down, yeah, because someone's winning. Or someone has won, I should say. Obviously, our party... Oh, wow. They have single-handedly beat everybody else. Wow. Would you look at that? I am surprised that a communist party has won without having to uh, beat anyone else. That is crazy, dude. Uh, so yeah, we're naturally gonna lose popularity. Donald Tusk is gonna be like, "Boo, we hate Donald, man." And the uh, right-wing populist here is gonna be growing. They got fourteen percent in the last elections. They're obviously at twenty-one percent, and these guys are obviously up and then down from the last elections. See if it gets to a point where they will. What's the word? We'll have. We can put like a. Put a. What's the word? Like an election through without any problems. These guys are almost finished training, but the Lightning McQueen's here still need some levels. Ukraine has taken some troops off their border. No, thank you. And boom. Infrastructure in Gotland's been done. Could think about going for some more investiture. Like, making sure East Germany has good roads. Just, just as an example. Because that's probably going to be a corridor should uh, war break out. So if we take you off and say an extra artillery, extra artillery, it makes it 38 and you're three width, right? Yeah. Could take off support artillery. 
light infantry back on. That would work. Okay, South Korea's having a civil war now, I'm assuming. Lovely. Okay, let's just get rid of you for a second. Artillery soft attack, yes please. What is going on in Asia? Korea's at war with Japan. Korea's at war with itself. Korea is at war with itself. This this whole area is just... What on earth is going on? Oh, damn. I can... Um... In some cases, like, where was it? Here, justify war goal. These guys have made tension. So, therefore, I could declare war on them. For example, Ukraine, I can't because they haven't generated any world tension. So. There you go. That's uh, part of the new policy. Interventionism. Do we want to be thinking about going for another uh, research slot? Research the national focus. What am I talking about? So I can effectively, if I go nationalist, I can get that for free. I can get neo-imperialism for free. If I just take that focus. Because we got one of the following. Let's go ahead and get another shipyard. 35 day focus. Croatia forms a new government. Lovely. Good for them. Sure, we will vote to enlarge the EU, why not? It was dismissed because Lithuania said no because they're leaving, and Ireland said no because they're leaving. Ireland is doing pretty well for themselves, they are nationalist. They are stagnating, have an okay economy, by the looks of things. We will vote yes, and we will decline for you. Korea. Proposal was accepted. Boom. Korea is beating Korea. And Korea is having a stalemate with Korea. Japan hasn't taken advantage of anything. Just yet. By the looks of things. Pressure other countries to recognize Palestine. It's kind of wild and with what's going on IRL, but we will see.
Another 10 billion in the bank. Investing some more infrastructure in Eastern Germany. Vote yes for the stability for the finances. The European Central Bank. <laughs> Outright monetary transaction is a program of the European Central Bank, which under the bank makes purchases. Outright transactions in secondary sovereign bond markets. Under certain conditions of bonds issued by Eurozone member states, the ECB wants to stabilize member states which interest rates are under the pressure of the global finance markets. So our interest rate is 0.8% because we have 300 billion in debt. So size limit for money just keeps going up and up and up to try and bring down interest rates. That that makes sense. You buy things to invest in countries so they don't have to be reliant on the global stock market effectively. Is what I'm reading into this thing. Could also think about after this nationalist propaganda campaign is done which granted hasn't gone crazy it's gone up to 25% which would just mean like maybe we form a coalition with the nationalists that ahead in the next election could think about um, trying to get that 7th research slot Go ahead, research the Leopard 2s. I'm assuming that's Leopard 2 for Poland. Brand new Bane Battle Tank. Which, by the way, we are making over one a day. Decline all those office sectors because they keep asking to build shit in places they can't build shit. Best in infrastructure in uh, Mecklenburg. And we have an extra dockyard, which we will automatically just ask for uh, one of those. Missile destroyers. Stealth ships. We'll, we'll go ahead and research it. Why not? I mean, we're not really planning on doing a, a big increase in, in an on-water fleet. Or a fleet in being, I should say. As the railway infrastructure in Poland just continues to uh, get better and better. What you like to see. We did in the last episode as well launch our very first satellite into space. So if we have a look here, you can see we've got five. We already had three and we uh, launched two into space. We are, of course, also, if we get rid of that tab, to go all the way down, we've got 180 days until we've got two 1995 OLVs. Um, next tech that's going to be done is gene targeting. 
So we do have 2005 ICBMs, um, which means we can grab the 2005 OLVs, which are obviously more reliable, can carry more, etc., etc. So I reckon we'll get uh, up to date OLVs. No reason why not to. We do have just an absolute a big ass stockpile of everything. Um, we should have remove, remove artillery, artillery. And then light infantry. That is a nine four with fifty four org. I'll save that and I will ask for six of them. And we'll say you can come out all the way over here. We don't want the east spying. We've gone into debt. Why have we gone into debt? Why why have we just taken out another 45 billion? What reason, sir? Wasn't any of these, because they're about to finish. Go ahead, repay that then. Uh, repay that, thank you. Was it the dockyards? Did I invest and then the dockyards came out? That could have been, that could be a reason. And the nationalist campaign's done. These guys got an extra 5%. <sighs> Caucus enlargement? No, because they're just... They're, these guys are just going to say no anyway, so there's no point in me saying yes. We said we were going to go OLVs, so that's what we're going to do. Thank you. 2005, 118 days. Boom shakala. And as you can see, from the growth in population that we've been having, steadily increasing, we do have two um, building slots available here. And Annette, we've actually got an extra one here. So that's lovely. Making 5.85 billion a week. Uh, sure. If you're actually going to build it, that is. We'll see. Um, we'll build some better roads in Berlin. More, more investments. Plus 2,000 guns. So we did use quite a few guns. That one artillery factory, we're making six and a half a week. Will that get up to one a day? Maybe. It's got 7%, potentially. Then have we got a tech that's... No, your population. And then we can go and grab... Factory output. That would flat just increase the amount we're producing. Lovely. Lovely jubbly.
Do we want to spend an extra 200 million on high police and intelligence funding for extra decryption, encryption, and stability? Yeah, sure. Why not? It's going to help the people in the long run. The American University in Armenia, the AUA, has been renovated. Don't know why the music stopped there, folks. My apologies. And we can go ahead, get stealth ships, and then we can just sit on the continuous focuses for a while. You're going to be done in two days. So then we'll have five of five producing missile submarines. Decline that investment offer from France. And now, because we are making 5.5 billion a week, I reckon we save and get that seventh research slot. Ba da da dum, ba da da dum, bum bum bum. Ba da 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 dum, bum bum. New attack helicopters. We could say we want a line of those at some point. Well, yeah, we'll put those. Just above transport helicopters. Because transports are actually more expensive to uh, to produce. Go ahead, make an office sector down here. Don't want to build one here, because that's a, a border state. Potentially, mid little river line. Are you... The river also comes down across the border. You guys can stop training. You guys can continue training. Maybe we make a second fort line in front of the first. No, oh, man. When I'm in here, I shouldn't be able to click divisions, guys. Shouldn't be a thing. That is, that, that is abysmal. Okay. That's all river. So we'll say level two, level two, level two, 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 two. Defense in depth. Sure. I like turkey. Thirty one billion. When we get thirty one billion, we'll offer it to Turkey. Sure. Even more people. 62,000 every month. It's like we're just printing people. It's crazy behavior. 25% ahead of time for advanced industrial robotics. And then more artillery research is done. You are just self-propelled AA. Are we making self-propelled AA, ladies and gentlemen? Let's check. Um... You're going to be under armored vehicles, aren't you? Self-propelled artillery. We're not, is the answer. So, I reckon we can get around that by researching that when we want to. So, that's fine by me. Five hundred days for the fifth gen multi-roll. 400 days for the next UAV. 400 days for an extra cast. In that case, then. 
go ahead and get LTE. Long term evolution. It's a standard for wireless broadband communication. Extra research speed, factory output, and reinforce rate. Yes, please. More of everything. Thank you, sir. And you guys could use one more main battle tank. Both of you at the top. You can come out there and then. You want to go on orange? Fuck off, game. It's having. It's got me balls in a vice grip. Turkey doesn't want any help. Let's propose a trade agreement with Bulgaria. Still got one with Greece, who are communist. Jeremy Corbyn is still in power, which is just completely wild. Resource exports. We're making money from petroleum and tech metals. That's it. No one's buying the steel or anything else. Kind of disappointing, chap. All those are maxed. It's so 1.2 billion. Let's do it. Even more people. Yes, please. Wow. That went up from 62,000 a month to 75k. Yeah, there's no reason why not to if it's going to give me extra building slots, right? But looking at the time, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to have to be it for today's episode. If you did enjoy, please do drop a like down below. It's greatly appreciated and helps these videos go out to more and more of you fine folk on YouTube. Uh, more every single day. And with that being said, I will see you tomorrow for the next installment of our Hard to Find playthrough. Take care. Bye-bye.